Keep an eye on Grants Pass with the Daily Courier's webcams located on the Rogue River, in downtown Grants Pass, and at the Rogue Valley Humane Society. See what's going on today at thedailycourier.com. Gordon Casimir Williamsy is getting ready to move in to his dream home. He's putting the finishing touches on a replica of a Vardo, frequently called a gypsy wagon. Well, my grandfather um, was, you know, lived in one when he was a kid, and he always told me about it. And, and it was a dream ever since I was like seven, I wanted to build one. Williamsy's family moved to Canada in the 1920s and from there emigrated to the United States. I was in Europe in 2009 at uh, the Sarah Cali Festival okay. in the south of France. And uh, it's all the Romani people in Europe gather there every, at the end of May. Williamsy was forced to seek alternative lodging when his hotel room was given away. All the regular locals were saying, don't sleep on the beach because the gypsies will kill you. And all the Romani people were saying, oh, be careful, don't sleep on the beach because all the gajo will, will, <laughs> will hurt you. And so they, this, this one guy uh, let me sleep in a Vardo, and then I was just completely hooked on him. After bouts with serious illnesses, including cancer, a heart attack, and diabetes, as well as unemployment, Williamsy found himself in Grants Pass, and it's here he started building his Vardo on a sturdy trailer frame that he can pull with his truck. Though it would be generous to call the Vardo spacious, it is roomier on the inside than you'd think by looking at the exterior. You know, in Japan, this would be more like a pretty big apartment, really. I've got a Pellet, uh, gravity fed pellet stove inside and, and um, okay. it's insulated all top to bottom. Now the problem is finding a place to park it. Problem is, is, is uh, I can't stay at RV parks because they don't allow custom built trailers. Oh. An online posting and a Daily Courier classified ad have provided some leads. If those don't pan out, Williamsy said he was contacted by a property owner in Malala, southeast of Portland, and has a good deal waiting for him there. You can read more about Gordon Casimir Williamsy and his Vardo in the March 5th print and online editions of the Daily Courier. When you're looking for serious buyers, go with what works, a Daily Courier classified ad. Call 474-3711 today.